can be as simple as going out for a walk in the evenings. Yeah, but if you step it up, you may have an easier time reaching your fitness goals. Fitness expert Stephanie Mansour has more. Good morning. Well, if you're looking to step it up when it comes to your evening walk, I've got some tips for you. So while cardio is really good and going for a walk is really good, it's great for your heart, it is good for weight loss, there are some ways that we can get a bigger bang for your buck when it comes to your walk. So first, I would like you to add in some strength training. So this can be really simple. You can walk for a block and then do 10 squats. Just bend at the knees, stick the, the booty back, and press down through the heels to stand up. So do 10 of those. Or you can walk if you're going through a park and you see a park bench. You can literally sit down on the bench and then stand back up and do that 10 times. Next, in order to work the arms, I recommend three pound or five pound dumbbells or you can even use water bottles, make sure they're filled up. And you can pump the arms as you're walking. So this is gonna add some weight and add some resistance to your walk. And it's also gonna help build muscle. So you can lift the arms up over your head or you can do some side extensions or even walk and do bicep curls. So gaining some muscle is crucial to being able to burn fat because muscle burns fat faster than fat burns fat. So it's important to include this strength training. And finally, when you are doing the walk, make sure that you're going you know, for one block fast and then one block slow. So really speed it up and then slow it down. This is going to keep your muscles and your body guessing because they'll never know what's gonna come next and therefore that's gonna help you burn fat faster. That's actually the premise of the workouts in my Step It Up With Stuff workout DVD. You want to always be changing up the pace of the cardio to keep your body guessing. So for even more tips, make sure you head on over to stepitupwithsteph.com and enter your first name and email address. Back to you guys.